Hi my angels, it's Haley Reese and for today's video I am finally going to be explaining what exactly I meant from my Shane Dawson video and answering your guys' questions. Because even though I didn't really want to go back and touch on this subject again because I think my first video was pretty self-explanatory, the questions don't stop coming in. And so I'm like, you know what, I feel like I kind of owe it to you guys to explain it a little further and explain why I created that video and hopefully give you guys the answers to all of the questions that that video has raised for you. Before I get into today's video though, I just very quickly want to say, if you are new to my channel or you are just not yet subscribed but you do enjoy my videos, hi, my name is Haley. my family on here is the Reese's Pieces, we believe in the unbelievable, so if you too believe in the unbelievable or you just want to hear about it, all you gotta do is go ahead, click that subscribe button and join our family because honestly, like, I love nothing more in my entire life than coming on here and sharing my experiences and connecting with you guys and this means the world to me so honestly it would mean so much if you joined our growing family and allowed me to continue to do that. So a little while back I posted a video titled I'm scared for Shane Dawson and in that video I basically just touched on how even though I love Shane and I love Shane's content I don't necessarily enjoy when he makes videos trying to summon demons. I think that that is kind of a very risky thing to be doing. Actually I know it's a very risky thing to be doing. But when I started to say that, I generated a lot of comments saying like, how can you be so hypocritical? Like, how can you say that you're scared for Shane Dawson, but yet your whole entire channel is like creepy paranormal stuff? And on one hand, yeah, I can completely understand where you guys are coming from. But that's one of the things that I really felt it was necessary to explain to you guys because I never want to come across as a hypocrite and I never want to come across as ever telling somebody what they can and cannot do. My intention of that video was never ever ever to have Shane stop creating his content. My intention genuinely from the bottom of my heart was because I know how many people watch his videos and I know how many people that watch his videos can be impressionable and I never wanted people to think, especially my viewers, to think that playing games like that is like just a game because it's not so ultimately my goal wasn't to make Shane stop my goal was to just hope that I can kind of not educate because I'm not trying to sit here and act like I'm some some mighty queen on my throne who knows everything just kind of like spread the awareness of the seriousness of it and kind of talk to you guys a little bit from my life experiences on how that can be a very dangerous thing. So let's start with me being hypocritical. I never was trying to be hypocritical. Clearly my channel touches on the paranormal far more often than not and that's just kind of how and that's just kind of the direction that my channel's taken naturally and I really enjoy creating that type of content for you guys. But the difference between the content that I'm creating and the content that some YouTubers create, not just Shane, there's tons of them, but I just, I watch Shane, so that's that's why the video was about him, but, um, and the content that they're creating in the sense of playing these demonic games is very different, because ultimately, like, I am sharing experiences, and I'm touching on the good and the bad, and I'm touching on the fact that there is an extreme power of intention within all of us, and we all have the power to create our own realities, and I always say that in almost all of my videos, like, no matter what you talk about or what you think about or what you share, ultimately at the end of the day you have the power to create a positive reality and you have the power to keep those things out. Now when you're playing these demonic games and you are kind of like summoning these things on, whether or not that thing is real, so let's say for an example I'm gonna play Bloody Mary, which by the way Bloody Mary scares the living daylights out of me ever since I was little, but okay let's say I'm gonna play Bloody Mary, right? And let's say Bloody Mary isn't real, okay? For argument's sake, I don't know if she is or isn't, but let's just say Bloody Mary isn't real, okay? And you're playing this game and you're like trying to summon something. And this isn't even like nearly as bad as like the other games, but you're trying to bring something on. Like I said, in this world there is good and there is bad. And through the power of intention, even if you're not playing the game right, even if the rules aren't being followed, even if you're not like really serious about doing it, these things are coming around and these things are watching <laughs> because you're trying to draw something in that is of negativity and you are vibrating on a negative level whether or not you even realize it. Now a lot of people were telling me, Haley, like Shane doesn't even play the games right, like he doesn't even, and that's totally okay and I'm sure he doesn't, I mean I know he doesn't, but 
he's making fun of it, he's taunting it, he's teasing it, and even if that particular thing is not real, like there are things around and they might be like, let me show this guy how real this is, and they might very well do that. And I never want to see that for anybody, especially not like someone that I, I look up to or aspire to, to be like in a sense. Like, I really didn't even need to make this video and I know that I didn't, but I just felt like I was constantly getting all of these questions being like, you're a hypocrite or he doesn't even play the game right. And I really just wanted to um, kind of clear the air on it just because I never want you guys to think that, um, one, that I was just creating that video just to clickbait and just to like get views from it because ultimately I enjoy creating my content and I take pride in the fact that I I take pride in the fact that when I post a video, the title is exactly what I'm going to talk about and exactly what I'm going to share and I try to be as real and authentic with you guys in all of my content and in all of my videos. So I never was intending to just like clickbait you guys and share just a bunch of nonsense and and continuing rant and continuous rambling like my whole intention was just to share with you guys because clearly you guys are interested in that type of content and interested in my content just to kind of like shed light on the fact that sometimes when you're playing these games you don't really realize what it is that you're attracting and you don't really realize that it can be a very serious thing I mean there are so many people who don't believe in any like of the other side and that's totally up to you like at the end of the day like I'm never gonna sit here and preach to you like what you should or shouldn't believe if you enjoy my content I love that you watch it if you don't or you don't believe in what I'm saying and you watch me for entertainment purposes I'm totally okay with that because we're all on our own journeys and we're all gonna believe different things but I have had so many experiences in my personal lifetime that have led me to believe that there is good and there is bad in the world and I just want to share with those of you who maybe have not had those experiences yet that it can be a very real thing. Far too often, and I've mentioned this in my previous video, people don't believe things until they happen to them and I would never want somebody to learn how real the spiritual world is by encountering something negative that they thought would never come. So that's basically why I made that video. I'm really not trying to be a hypocrite. Um, although I talk about experiences and I shed light on things in the spiritual realms and the spiritual world, um, I always have the power of intention of never trying to attract those things. So many of you guys ask me like, by watching your videos, am I attracting these things? And the answer to that is no. <laughs> I mean, um, what attracts things is the power of intention and the power of thought. And so at the end of the day, if you watch somebody's videos and you seriously put out there that you don't want to attract these things and that you're protected by a white light and that you're not going to let these things into your reality, chances are you're not going to attract them. But I mean, like, I'm just a girl here on YouTube sharing my experience. Experiences. I'm definitely not like a freaking expert in everything and I never want to and I never want to come across as like I am but um but yeah I mean my content just sharing stories and the content of bringing things on or trying to jokingly taunt these demonic games is very different because like I said I'm getting very repetitive now but just like the intention of it and like what you're thinking of and what your heart is radiating and what um, vibration you're vibrating on when you're doing those things so now I've just rambled. I really hope that you guys um, understand why I wanted to make this video and I really hope that it kind of clears the air on a couple of things. I never want to see like Shane stop creating his um, controversial videos. I personally don't enjoy watching the ones where he summons things for obvious reasons. Um, I think that would make me a hypocrite if I'm like, guys, that's so bad and then I'm like watching it. But I enjoy the rest of his content quite a bit and like my intention is never to bash anybody. I have like nothing but the utmost respect and love for Shane as a whole. And I obviously love all of you guys and I know that a lot of you watch both me and Shane and I love that very much. And um, I really wanted to clear up my reasoning for creating that video. It was never to um, stop his channel, not even stop his channel, because like, come on Haley, you're irrelevant. Um, <laughs> my intentions were never to try to like have you guys stop watching his videos or anything like that. I just really wanted you guys to understand before you go trying to play these games that even if that game is fake, even if you play the rules wrong, sometimes you, you can and you will attract something very real. Well you guys, I really hope that you kind of understand where I was coming from by making this video. I love you guys all so much and I never want any of you to bring anything negative into your lives. I think if anything, my main purpose with sharing spiritual videos and sharing both the good and the bad is to just really share with you guys that you have the power over your own reality and you can choose to attract or expel things into or out of your reality and I think that that is one of the most 
valuable gifts in your life is just knowing that no matter even if it's not spiritually like financially relationships like prosperity all of those things are in your own control and you can you can genuinely create your own realities and you can you can make great or horrible things happen and i never want to see anything horrible happen to any of you or sheen so yeah if you guys enjoyed today's video but you are not yet subscribed please go ahead and click that subscribe button i post a ton of videos i don't want you to miss when i upload and please give this video a big thumbs up i have nothing but love for shane i have nothing but love for you guys and i never ever had any form of negative intentions in creating that video remember my loves do all things with kindness and until next time i love you